السلام عليكم يا ديار براس اسيستس ويلكم باك ناشن ديس يا برا عبد محمد نور اوكي ويز جو تشيك فور يو ماتيماتكس اوف فورم 3 ديس تايم فادر لوغاريزم اوكي فادر لوغاريزم اوكي از وات يو ار جوين تو لان اكشلي جايز اي شو يو ان شاء الله غو ريدي ا لوت اوف اكزامبلز سو ذات ستاند ذا ديفرنت كونسبت اوف فادر لوغاريزم ان فورم 3 اوكي ليتس جو اند ستارت ذا بيسك وانس اوكي ليتس هايلايت ذا كونسبت اوف فورم 2 هير اكزامبل 1 Example one, you are told convert the fluent to index form. Okay, we are told express express the fluent in in logarithm. Okay, logarithm notation. Logarithm notation, okay. I have the first one a five power three is equal to one hundred twenty-five. Okay, let me solve this one. This is what you normally call indices. Yeah, just understand that. So for the solution part, when you want to to convert this one into logarithm form, this is what you're going to do. This is what you're having five power three is equal to one hundred twenty-five. So you introduce log. You're going to say log. Then this remember this your base and this the power, okay? So you retain your base, you're going to say 5, then interchange these two for the position. So you're going to say 1, 2, 5 is equal to what? 3. So this will be the final answer, just understand. It's equal to what? It's equal to 3. We are interchanging these two for the position under, taking this one as our base. Then we solve another one. Uh, B, your total, 2 power 7 is equal to 128. This is the index form, okay? When you come to the solution, you're going to say, Log base 2, retain this one. Interchange these two for the position then. By 128 is equal to 7, okay? This is the final answer for your information, guys. Uh, let's see the opposite of this one, example 2. Example what? Example 2, let's see example 2. Your total, convert the flowing to index form. Convert the flowing. To index form. Okay? They will give you in what? In logarithm form. This is question A. We have question A as log base 4 by 1024 is equal to 5. Then we have question B as log base 3 by 81 is equal to 4. So these are in log form, is it? So we are going to convert them into index form, yeah? So the first one we are having is what? Log base 4, the power of 1024 is equal to what? Is equal to 5. Just understand that. Yeah? 1024 yeah, is equal to 5. So what are we going to do? We are going to do over, we are going to do what you know we call opposite of what we have been doing right now. We are going to eliminate this one. Yeah, we eliminate this one. Over. Then we will retain this one. 4, interchange this two again for the position. 4 power 5 will give you what? 1024, you can confirm from the calculator. This is 1024, okay? This is the final answer. What are we doing? We are eliminating the lock, then interjecting these two for the position and detailing our, our base. Yes, and send that. Okay? This is A. Let me go to B. B, we have what? Lock base 3 by 8, 1 is equal to 5. Sorry, it's equal to 4. So what are we going to do? Eliminate this one. Then it will change the position. This two are taking for them the position. So it will be 81. And that is the final answer for your information, guys. Here we are introducing lock here. And uh, with this concept, we are eliminating the lock. Just understand that. Okay? Let's see example 3. Example 3, yeah? Let's see example 3. Okay? Let's see example. Example 3. Okay. Uh, we have a question of this kind. Let's also write this one at all. Evaluate the following without using tables. The following without using tables. Without using what? Tables. Okay. So here we have uh, question A, 
log 125 plus log 8. Log 8. So remember when we are when we're dealing with the log, okay? Plus means what? Multiplication, don't forget that. Come to the solution. Log 125 plus log 8 can be written as log outside 125 times 8. So this will give us what? Log 1000. So it will give us what? The degree. Most of the teachers are saying log 1000. You see now? Look at this point here. Yeah? Lock 1000 is equal to 3, but they are not going to inform you where this 3 comes from. You ask yourself, where are they getting this 3? Ask yourself. So, alternatively, when you reach here, you can say, let me prove that log 1000 is equal to 3. You can say, log, look here, log uh, 1000. Okay? Let, you're going to say let, sorry, let. Let, understand, yeah? Let log a thousand b x but remember with this is written in log base 10 okay like what log base 10 okay you can write this one as log base 10 so you can say this is what you can say log base 10 by a thousand is equal to what is equal to x so you introduce so you're going to say cancel this log right in this one it will be 10 eh? 10 power x is equal to a thousand. Okay? Because we said it in our previous example, we said that we are going to eliminate what? Lock when we want to write the index form. So this can be written as 10 power x is equal to 10 power 3. So cancel this thing. So x is equal to what? x is equal to 3. That's where they're getting that uh, till they just understand that. Okay? But they will never inform you these guys. Okay? Let's go. Let's see this one. Let's see this one. B. We have a, B, we have a, uh, log 64 minus log 4. Okay? Yes, understand this thing. So the moment you have minus, it means what? It means division, not to be that. So this can be written as solution. We have log 64 minus log 4 can be written as log in 64 divided by 4. So it will give us what? Log 16, yeah? Okay? Log 16. Can't you see? It's what? Log 16, okay? That's where you're going to be because you cannot go ahead. This is the final answer for your information. So now let's see more critical examples. Examples that can help you during a KCSC. That was the thesis of logarithm, further logarithm of form 3 for your information, guys. Okay, let's see this one. You are taller, given that, given that, you are tall, given that, log 2 is equal to 0. Point. 3010 okay and log 3 is equal to 0 0.4771 one. find comma without using find without using logarithm tables Logarithm tables or a calculator or a calculator comma the value of the value of a at twelve log twelve. So I'll solve this one. This is log twelve, remember? So I come to the solution. Log twelve is from here. Let me factorize this one. By two six, by two three, by three one. So you can write this one as log two alpha is from here. Is equal to log two plus another log two plus log three. Okay, just understand that. 
So this can be written as 2 into log 2 plus log 3, okay? So you can say 2 into, what is the value of log 2? The value of log 2 is what? Let me get our calculator. Yeah? The value of log 2, it is there. It is 0 0.3010, just understand that. Plus, log 3 is what? 0 0.4771, okay? So it's 0 0.3010 times 2, yeah? So that will give you what? 0 0.6020 plus 0 0.4771, okay? Plus 0 0.4771, okay? So it will be 1.0. 791 that would be the final answer okay for question a just understand that okay then we'll go to our next example here okay which will be b now for your information we have another one as log 54 look at this one it is log 54 okay log 54 let's for 54 54 2 27, 3, 3, 9, this is 9, yeah, 27 divided by 3 is 9, 3, 3, 3, 1, okay, so this log 54 can be written as log 2 plus 3 log 3, open the bracket, over 3 log 3, yeah, just understand that, okay, which is equal to, uh, log 2 is what? Log 2 is 0 0.3010 plus 3 into 0 0.4771. Just understand that. Okay? So this is what they're going to say. They're going to say what? 0 0.3010 plus 0 0.4771 times what? Times 3, okay? That is 1.4313, okay? Plus 0 0.3010, okay? So that will give you what? 1.7323. And that will be also the final answer for your information, okay? That will be the final answer for your information, okay? Okay? Now let me add some more examples before we go to the application part. Let me add more examples before we go to the application, application part, okay? Before we go to the application part for your information, guys. Before we go to the application part, add this one. You are told evaluate. Evaluate. Look at this one. Evaluate. Log base 3 bar 25.67. Given your answer. Giving your answer, giving your answer, giving your answer to four significant figures. Four significant figures. So here, uh, we don't have, we have this one, look here. We have log base 3 is power, power 25.67. This is what they are giving. So we are going to say, let log base 3 power 25.67 be y or equal to y, yeah? just understand. You can even take m or x, yeah? So you can eliminate this one, then it will be 3 power y is equal to 25.67 because we are eliminating the log. Don't forget here we have log base 3, remember? So we are eliminating this log, just understand, yeah? We are eliminating what? The log here, just understand. Then here, what are we going to do? Then we are introducing, say introducing lock. Again, introducing what? Lock again on both sides of the equation. On both sides of the, of the equation. Look at this point. Look at this statement. We introduce. Then we are going to say y log 3 is equal to log 25.67. We are introducing log, so the moment you introduce log, this will be the coefficient, the bar. So to get y, we will divide log 3, here also, log, uh -huh. 
3. Cancel. So y is equal to get your calculator again. Get your calculator. So you're going to say log log change 5.67 to 5.67 divided by log 3. Okay? So this will give us uh, 2.95, yeah? Uh, four to four significant figures and that will be uh, the final answer uh, for your information okay that will be the final answer for your information okay okay so that will be the final answer for your information let me add some more examples before I stop because I want to go in our next video the application part okay Yes, understand the application when I'm saying are uh, post questions that can come during KCAC. Yeah? These are the fundamentals you have to understand. These are the basic concepts, okay? So this one, look here. You are told, uh, you are told solve for x in the equation. Solve for x in the equation. So this one is from two concepts, but I will help you. You have 3 power x is equal to 8. So this is index form and this is a whole number. So we write this one. We'll ask ourselves which number can we multiply or uh, yeah, 3 times will give us this one. Okay, we can say now, look at this point. If now we cannot write this one as this 3, just understand. So what are we going to do? You cannot say, if we write like this, look here, if we say 3 power x is equal to 2 power 3, do not help us because the 2 powers will not cancel. So you're going to say, Introducing again, you introduce lock, introducing lock on both sides, on both sides of the equation, okay? Both sides of the equation. You introduce lock on both sides of the equation. So you can say we have 3 power x is equal to 8. This can be written as x log 3 is equal to log of what? 8. Then to get x here, we're going to divide by log 3. Here also log 3 cancel so x is equal to get the calculator again make sure you have a calculator so this log 8 divided by log 3 so that will give us 1.8928 and that will be the final answer uh, for that uh, question okay just understand that okay guys i think you understand this thing uh, God willing, in our next class, you're going to see the same, same concept, but the ones that normally come in KCAC. There are even some that will go into quadratic, okay? Some will go into several challenge equations, okay? Some will also use the addition, a subtraction, and multiplication that go. So, guys, that's what we'll be seeing, inshallah, in our next class. Otherwise, I wish you the best, okay?